Hello guys, I started 22 with quite a lot of focus on Livewire and today I'm presenting my new component on my Livewire kit, number 37, which is, if we go to the bottom of the list, Password Strength Indicator. In this video I will show you how it works visually and how it works in the code. So first, a demo, so how it works, you have a password field and if you start typing password in real time, it measures the strength of the password with external package and I will show you that in a minute. So it goes from weak to good to strong. So it doesn't change anything around the password, it just changes the text and the progress bar at the bottom. Just a visual indicator for the user who is registering. Now how does it look in the code? It's pretty simple actually. Password generate component has the password property and then the strength score which is calculated with external package and I will get to that and then there's array of levels score and then text which to show then in the render it just renders the password with the indicator and if we take a look at that blade file we have wire model password then password strength is calculated from that array or if the array element doesn't exist for that reason the default is weak and then there's html element progress so the strength in words and progress visually and that score is updated with live wire method updated property updated password in this case we calculate the score we assign that to the property of strength score which in turn also refreshes this strength score and changes the text now two things to get deeper into did you know about progress html thing i found out pretty recently myself actually that there is html element for this so this one this progress bar it actually looks a bit differently in different browsers and operating systems but if we take a look at the documentation at mozilla org there is a progress where you can define max and value for example 70 or 60 or whatever so there's no need for any JavaScript plugins or anything like that. Of course, you can do some external stuff if you want it more visual or more customizable or something like that. But this is the default HTML, which works in all major browsers. And another thing to dive deep in is this class. What is ZXCVBN? It's a pretty weird name actually, but this comes from a package called the same name PHP, and it's actually a PHP version of a more global package. So this is the one for PHP with 600 stars, but it's actually based on the JavaScript project from Dropbox. So there's the project with the same name for password strength estimator. And you can dive deeper on how it works in terms of algorithm. The link will be in the description below of this video. But to use it from PHP point of view, it's not even Laravel package. It's a PHP package. You just create a new class and you call the method that you want. Password strength, for example. Also, there's explanation what number actually means under the hood. So again, you can read the docs. The link is in the description below. So this is the new Livewire component on my Livewire kit number 37 and that number is important because I'm getting closer to 39 where I will raise this price. Currently the price for all components is $29. As soon as I release the 39th component the price will become $39. And I'm expecting to work quite a lot with Livewire in upcoming weeks or months so I expect that I reach the 39th component in a few weeks or so. So you can still get that for cheaper price. And by purchasing that, you get the access to this repository with all the components. So whenever I release some new components, you won't have to pay for that anymore. It's a one-time payment to get access to this repository. So go to livewarekit.com if you want that and see you guys in other videos.